Hi guys, in this video we're going to take a look at some best practice tips on how to install the three channel version of the Wiser second generation Hub R. In the box there is the three channel Hub R along with its backplate and an installation guide. The relay contacts are designed to align with systems that have existing physical zoning with two separate zones of central heating and one hot water zone that can be turned on or off in the Wiser Home app making it perfect for use with larger combi boilers. Before commencing work, make sure that the electricity supply to the heating system can be safely isolated. The backplate utilises cage clamp screw type terminals ensuring secure connection of all the conductors with a knockout at the bottom to provide access for surface mounted cables. The Hub R should be positioned on a wall a minimum of 300mm away from the boiler and the heating system protected by a 3 amp fused spur. As the Wiser Hub R manages connections to both Wi-Fi and the devices network, the more centrally located it can be within the property will reduce the need for signal boosting. Once the backplate is wired, the Hub R can be fitted to the backplate by hooking on at the top, pressing in at the bottom and doing up the two screws. Power can now be reinstated and the Wiser second generation Hub R will go through its boot up sequence that will take up to two minutes and it is important not to interact with the Hub R during this process. After two minutes, the Hub R will show a solid green setup light. To test that the wiring is correct, the override buttons can be pressed and held for three seconds to manually fire the channels. A further press stops the core for heat. Now that the Wiser second generation Hub R has been installed, the system needs to have at least two Wiser temperature controlling devices added to the system and this is done using the Wiser Home app on an Apple or Android phone. The Wiser Home app features an installer mode that allows the system to be set up without the need to connect to the home Wi-Fi or register an account by scanning the QR code and connecting directly to the Hub R. This means that the usual commissioning steps like adding devices, assigning to rooms and setting up schedules can be done and the system can be handed over to the customer to complete registration. The range of Wiser second generation devices offer both smart heating and smart home capability so the home can be made much more automated and efficient. So that's how to install the Wiser second generation 3 channel Hub R. For more information on this and to find out what other smart devices you can add to the system, head over to our website and don't forget to check out the other videos on our YouTube channel, Drayton Heating.